we all really want to win and we all want to work hard towards winning. We don't think that just because we've done so well in the past years that other teams are just going to give it to us. We know that people know who we are because of how well we've done and we have to work for what we want. These past couple years have been really good team-wise. I've made some of my best friends on this team who I believe will be with me for the rest of my life. And it doesn't feel like we're really friends. It feels like we're more of like a small family because of how closely knit we are. Honestly, it's a really great program. There's a lot um, of extras that we have here. We have ETS, which is uh, one of our fitness programs that we go through during the season, which uh, helps with like injury prevention and also helps us improve as players throughout the year. Also, we have a really great coaching staff. We're really hard on academics and we wanna make sure that everyone, while they're doing well on the court, they're also doing well off the court. The way I approach as a coach, like you're here to be a student first. You have to be a successful student in order to play volleyball. You have a certain grade point average. Uh, if you're a scholarship athlete, you have a certain grade point average to receive that. School is gonna get you where you wanna be. Once you get that under your belt, then you become the athlete. And that's what we work hard on to make sure that they're, they're successful in the court that way. You meet a lot of new people on the sports teams and you make a lot of new friends, so it just kind of um, makes you feel more comfortable coming from high school. We know it's a big jump going from high school to college. We do uh, open gyms for the summertime. Um, sometimes we know the kids two summers ahead and we'll have them come out just to meet the girls and train and try to get them to the next level and, that, and then just help ease that transition. Getting to know some of the girls before even starting school helped a lot because you kind of just, you make friends through it because you already have a common interest. We try our best to make sure that it's a second family and you feel welcome and you feel comfortable. We want them to come in and go, hey, I know 10, 12 other people, and then they feel a little more comfortable and a little more stable. A lot of the teachers are really understanding for first years and they try to help you as much as possible and as long as you let them know um, when you're missing things and you're going to make up for them, uh, they're pretty understanding of all that. So when I recruit, I talk to the athletes about uh, potential athletes, what, what programs they're, they're interested in. We have a lot of good programs that we can utilize here and really try to say sell Durham for what it is. We have tons of amenities that a lot of other schools don't have. We have an academic athletic study room that was provided for us. We all go up there to study sometimes or just to finish homework. I think it's really good having the team room kind of as a place to go in between class, before practice, after practice really helps out. We have like ice tubs in the back of the room that I usually use almost every time after practice. The gyms that we have are up to date Nice equipment that we get to utilize, our hitting boxes, our AccuSpike, setting targets, passing targets. Having like people be there to set it up for us to make sure everything's right and perfect, it's really helpful. It doesn't really put extra stress on us. One of the big programs that we utilize is the ETS, Elite Training Systems. That's something that a lot of schools don't have for varsity only training sessions to help your athletes to increase their speed and vertical and to avoid therapy. Therapy we have, we have two great trainers every year that are overseen by our therapy staff. Our athletes are easy, uh, pretty strong and do avoid injury as much as possible. We have a great coaching staff, um, Tony especially. He knows how to reach out to the girls and how to get them uh, motivated during practice. I think what's so good about our coaching staff is that they respect us as players. Respecting your players is very important and kind of encourages people to play and work hard. Sometimes when we're looking down and stuff, he'll always try to bring out the positivity as well as our assistant coaches. Everyone is a well-rounded coach and they always try to help us to the best of their ability. We always want to give back and say like, you know, we are a community college and we want to give back to the community. We raised money for Breast Cancer Awareness Month and for November. And we did our annual gift exchange with the YWCA. 
we do the best to bring in club teams and like high school teams, elementary teams. When they come in, we do little special signings, like little cards and that, make them feel important and they go, oh, this is something I can maybe do later on. So we just really want to give back to say, hey, we are Durham College, the women's volleyball program. We want to be part of the community, we want to be active and we want to help as much as we can. Honestly, just go out and work as hard as you possibly can, even if you think you won't have a starting spot. Um, everyone works to where they need to get to. And if you want to be on the court, just show it and you'll get there.